is here. It's hard to believe it's been two decades on the hunt in WWE. The following contest is a no holds barred match. Making his way to the ring, representing RK Bro from St. Louis, Missouri, weighing in at 250 pounds, the Viper Randy. Ice water in his veins and death in his eyes. Randy Orton has left a trail of fallen that has spanned over two decades. And there are very few champions in this game who are more decorated than the Apex Predator. And we also know that when Randy Orton goes to that place, it's over. A competitor who knows what he's doing at all times. That's why there's only one Apex Predator, and his name is Randy Orton. A fight against the ultimate opportunist is the ultimate opportunity. I hope this superstar doesn't crumble under the magnitude of the opportunity. Once again, claimed his spot atop WWE. A Hall of Famer who has survived judgment and embraced his darker side to become even more dangerous than ever before. And his opponent from Toronto, Ontario, Canada, weighing in at 249 pounds. You know, Edge has won and cashed in the very first Money in the Bank contract, but he's found so many unique ways to win. He is truly the ultimate opportunist. This isn't going to be pretty. He got whipped into that corner. Randy Orton gets him back. Oh, what a clothesline. This is just establishing dominance. Oh, Ooh, I stopped right to the chest. Are you kidding me? Orton measuring him. A knee smash. Yeah. Look at this. Just unloading. Yeah. And a Ooh. stop to the gut, too. An aggressive charge against Edge now. Seems like Orton is trying to totally incapacitate Edge. Edge showing signs of slowing down. Orton with a fast press by Randy Orton. This could do it! And he could have had a three count in hand. I've, I've got to question this decision. And he's able to counter. Edge reversing the momentum on him. Yeah, Edge able to stop that surge dead in its tracks. Sit down, powerbomb! In a no disqualification match, you never want to be the superstar on the wrong end of a chair or a kendo stick or whatever else might be hiding under the ring. You want to be the one inflicting that punishment because that's how you control the pace and the match as a whole. Battling ringside and our announce table's getting shaky. That's because Byron is quivering in fear next to me. When the fight comes out here, guys. Bang! Oh. Oh. And the damage is just going to keep on coming if you can't find the defense for this. Oh man, they do not care who or what they destroy. 
destroy. Yeah, Byron, you are dangerously close to being collateral damage in this one. Bang. And he is daring his opponent to face him with the steel chair. He knows how to avoid contact. Getting sucked. Uh-oh. They're on the table. They're going to take it to the next level. What is this superstar thinking? They're thinking about the end. Finishing this thing off by any means necessary. Counters. This could be an opportunity. Brilliant countering by both competitors. Close line. Battling at ringside can be very unforgiving. You have to be careful out there. No protection out here. No safe confines to speak of. Exploder suplex from Orton. And now as this match goes on, Edge finding himself even more on the defense. That's just Orton doing what he does best and letting him know he's not going anywhere. Boom. Oh, he's setting him up. Oh, no. This is, this is going to be bad. to destroy Edge. I guess he thinks the one thing missing in this match was a steel chair. He leaves the ring and there's no countouts in this one. It's a table. I'm not sure what he's scheming, but it can't be good. Randy Orton showing no mercy. Edge needs to be resourceful in this situation. He's taking this to the floor now. Longer. A hockey stick? I, I 
I see, he does not just want to hurt the competition. He wants to embarrass them. Oh, square shot with the back elbows ends that. Stiff elbow will break that up. That's something Edge did want to face. Strange game plan for sure, but hey, maybe he has something even bigger and better planned. <laughs> Consecutive attacks landing on Edge. This devastating offense from Orton is so hard to compare for. This battle between Edge and Orton has been just ferocious. Edge and Orton fighting like their lives are on the line. He's in a little bit of trouble now. Edge is certainly delivering attacks with more malice as the match goes on. The ultimate opportunist. Watch out. Turn to the ring. Ah. European uppercut. 
He's stalking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. Up high! shifting with every turn in the match. He reverses it. Orton so evasive. Table behind him now, not where you want to be. And that definitely made solid impact. Edge is certainly fighting from behind now. My goodness! That table exploded! I don't think we should be worried about the table, Saxon. There's a human being under the wreck. Slithering. Edge is in a perilous position. The counter. And that can be a first step towards Edge gaining control. Could be what Edge needed to ignite a rally. He refuses to stay down. Pure instinct. Precision offense from the Viper. Edge's defenses are being mowed down. There's electricity running through this arena right now. Will it be the spark for one of these competitors? Orton never saw that coming. If he was looking for an opportunity to pull a 180, that could be it. The defenses are sharp in this series of reversals. Catches the leg. Clothesline right, takes him down. Forget about it. That'll turn your lights out. Fans off the attack with an elbow. He's showing it's not time for lying down. It's time for fighting back. Gets the better there. Boom! Up on the turnbuckle now. Uh oh. Uh oh. From the top. DDT from the top rope. An aggressive charge against Edge now. The attacks will not relent from the Viper. the apron. Oh, this is going to be bad. This is going to be really bad. Back suplex. Spine crushing. Again, the torso is punished. The core of the entire anatomy could dramatically slow your movement down. And what need is there to go looking under the apron like this? Leaving nothing to chance here with a baseball bat in hand. He's back into the ring. Orton now dictating the pace here. Edge keeps getting caught off on the pass. Saw that coming. Every successive move is putting their opponent in a dicey situation. He's looking to take this fight to a whole new level. a match people will be telling their kids about for years to come. Here's another look.
Here is your winner, the Viper, Randy Orton. What a hard fought win for Randy Orton. He knew Edge wasn't going to go quietly, but these two ended up having one heck of a fight. I wonder if Orton thinks he's proven his point against Edge. I wonder if his betrayal was worth it. Just look at the satisfied smile on Orton's face, Saxton. This is exactly what he wanted to do. Crush his former friend. In Orton's mind, he's shown Edge in the whole WWE Universe that this dispute is over, and Edge should go home and retire for good.